cső, itt vagyok megint. Ugyanint nem folytatjuk. Beszélj. Shit. You trying to give me another heart attack? No, I just... Komos van 35. Akkor ez is veszem egy 50 Sure, you saw the whole thing, and that makes you special. Always looking out the window, sticking your nose in everyone else's business. I just want to get your butt let out. Was it good, you two? Never been as much in that, huh? You look lost. What's lost is my body. I know I got killed right here, and I know it sounds crazy, but but I'd feel a lot better if. If I knew where my body was, are you a detective or something? You might be my only hope. Yeah, I'm a detective. Any idea who did it? That might lead us to your body. I know they were old people, and I know they lived in this apartment building. Other than that, everything was hazy. But I was doing a lot of drugs at the time. Sounds like you do need a detective. I'll see what I can find out from any older residents of the building. Okay, go check it, check Nikki. That was it. Here you go, boy. Keep on like right today. Anyone sleep through music blasting like that? I think she was on drugs. Walter was so tired he couldn't bear this weight for the whole night to drive to Smithwick Quarry. I couldn't believe he was able to find a pair of lock cutters that late at night. At least the music has stopped. Now we can finally sleep. Ezek ezek az ilyen emberek. Ezért tudjanak tévét, nézze meg, jönnek egy ember. 
hope you find something. Ja so like I said. Looks like Grace couldn't take the girl's party anymore, so she killed her and roped her husband into helping dump the body at Smithwick Quarry. I should get back and let her. Turns out. The reason you can't find your body is because it's not in the building. It's at Smithwick Quarry, about five miles out of town. Oh. Well, why'd they do it? The parties were keeping them awake at night. They finally got too tired and snapped. I, I thought they were just being unreasonable. I didn't know they would do this. <sighs> Thanks for your help. You have no idea how big a relief it is just knowing. No problem. You know, I never really liked cops. And they were always giving me shit, telling me how I was messing up my life. We never saw eye to eye on things. But you really came through for me. Probably should have listened to what they were trying to tell me. Maybe then things wouldn't have ended up like this. Thanks again. What I did. Egy ügy magolva. Be kell kapszam sem a dolgokat. Itt meg még jól. Jött meg ez a nő. A tévét tudom. Nem. Ezt a zavarni az adás lehet benne, akkor meg nem tudom azt. Come back. Did I do that? Hey, hey, come back. Those notes aren't for you. Great. Looks like some sort of code or something. All right, well, I made it up to the fourth floor before the police cart away the evidence. Okay, well, what am I? Sham hustle. Enjoy scaring kids? This little girl cost me everything. It was supposed to be a simple job. Easy money. What do you mean? She's just a kid. It don't matter what she is. Her daddy owed too much to the wrong people. She was just an insurance policy. Is that where you come in? A simple snatch and grab. After everything was settled up, I, I let her go. I'm guessing it wasn't so simple. That may be. But she owes me now. I ain't leaving till her debt is paid. Cut your losses. Maybe it will. Don't worry. 
I can wait. Okay. De miért így van nekünk a táncolni, ha hát, akkor nem tudom. Ik ben aan het wandelen. So much noise. It's quiet now. Quiet, quiet. I'm sorry, kid. It shouldn't have come to this. Okay, that's a young boy. I'm glad it was like.
That's one time you gonna have to design. Okay, man, so keep it cool there, okay? Okay, folks, I need you to keep your distance from the scene here. Okay, Ed, my boy. Hey, Broyles. You seen that little girl that lives here? She turns up. You come find me. Got it? Oké, okay, akkor itt lesz a videó vége. Vagy még ezt egy bújlát összeszedjük. Jól nem végszem. Hol a fürdőbe kell lenni, csak meg kell találnom a fürdőt. És itt is van. I still remember seeing the ad for the Regal Apartments in the paper. It's easy for people to look at it and see a dingy, run-down shithole. But me? I saw a place with history and character. I saw a place full of artistic inspiration. Before I knew it, I was the official tenant of apartment 3A. Looking back on it, I wish I had never even unpacked. My new apartment turned out to have more character than I had anticipated. The carpets were occasionally soggy. The pipes were rusty, and I could hear the tenant below me banging against the walls and screaming at the top of his lungs. Sure, there were other problems with the place, but they just added to its charm. They were things I could live with. What I couldn't live with was showering in brown water, mysterious leaks molding the carpet, and obnoxious neighbors. I called the plumber, who arrived just as I was about to have a word with the people downstairs. When I showed him the wet spots on the carpet, he scratched his head and explained that nothing was leaking and that the reason for the wet spots was most likely due to me spilling something and not realizing it. Did this guy take me for an idiot? I never spilled a thing. He apologized and said that without a leak, there's nothing he could do, so he moved on to the shower. Thankfully, the water had no trouble turning brown. He thought it could be an issue with a rusty boiler and went to check it out. I took the opportunity to address the tenants below. I knocked on the door, but no one answered. In fact, I couldn't hear anything at all. I tried the door, expecting it to be locked, but it just swung open. I was shocked to find it completely empty. That's when wet footprints began to appear on the floor. They were headed right for me. Just then, I could hear the plumber scream from the boiler room downstairs. By the time I ran down there, he was long gone, but he had discovered the source of the brown water. Packed into the old, rusty boiler was a bloated, decomposing corpse. The police are still investigating the homicide, and the landlord has promised to renovate the boiler room. However, despite his efforts, 3A is back on the market, and I doubt I'll ever feel clean again. Okay, see you later.
pont jó mese volt. Úgyhogy a cigi a szájba. Úgyhogy, na, cső.